Hey guys, good morning and welcome to my channel here Liciously. It is another beautiful day here in Northern Virginia and my hair just looks crazy this morning. But I'm very thankful for the hair that I have and the fact that I can wake up just looking like this uh, just really makes me happy. But anyway, today I wanted to go over my earnings on YouTube AdSense for the month of April. And so I wanted to share with you guys how much that I made uh, last month. Now, if you guys recall my previous video for the month of March, I made a total of about, I think, close to $31 or $32. So let me show you guys how much I made for April. Last month, I actually made $65.52, more than doubling what I made for March. And since AdSense payouts threshold is going to be $100, I'm actually going to be getting my first paycheck from Google. So anyway, you guys can see the overview. My minutes went up, the audience retention went up, the views and the subscribers all went up, which is a good thing. So let's move on to the watch time. So the watch time has been consistently linear um, in relation to the video uploads and the views that I've been getting. So I can only predict that it's continuing to go up as I gain more subscribers and as I post more videos. The average duration has also gone up too and I'm currently averaging about 2 minutes and 15 seconds which is approximately 34% of my videos being viewed by the viewers. I think a good average duration is probably going to be closer to 50% if not higher but I also predict this to go up uh, for my channel and since my videos are usually around four to five minutes long, hopefully the average duration is gonna to continue to increase. Now, the earnings, they're all gonna depend on the type of niche your videos are based on, as well as the views and the clicks you receive from the ads. So in my case, my, uh, you know, most of my videos are gonna be pertaining to hair loss and hair transplants. So different topics can earn more or less money depending on you know, what kind of videos you guys make. As far as the views, I've been getting a constantly increasing views of about somewhere between 2,500 to 3,000 views per day. And I do know that views have a lot to do with your earnings. So obviously the higher the views, the higher the earnings. And finally, the earnings portion. If you guys take a look, I started earning at least $2 per day starting on the 20th. And if you guys look on the 25th, I actually ended up earning more than $6, which is really good. The average um, daily earnings have continued to go up, so I can speculate that I should hit at least or close to $100 for, uh, for May's earnings. You know, I, I never thought that I'd actually start earning money from the videos that I made, so I'm very happy to see a lot of these earnings going up. Um, you know, my intention for the earnings is to do giveaways to my subscribers, um, you know, things like hair loss products. Um, if I make enough money, I wanted to give out a, um, a laser comb. So, you know, once again, thank, thank you guys so much for all of your support and, you know, for watching my videos because without the viewers, this wouldn't be possible. So for those who are actually interested in doing hair loss videos or, you know, documenting the hair transplant progress, um, I feel like you can easily make a few hundred dollars if you're just really persistent and you make good quality videos. Um, I know that some people take medications to treat their hair loss, such as uh, Propecia or Rogaine or you know other types of hair loss products. And even if you're looking to get a hair transplant and you end up you know using your credit card to pay it off, the earnings that you guys make on YouTube can you know at least pay off the credit card bills or somewhat help you guys financially to cover the costs of hair loss or hair transplants. Anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Uh, give it a thumbs up and I'll talk to you all next time. Peace.